Good day everybody. This is the how to tie a canoe on the car properly video. And it stars me. And uh, this uh, show is directed by Joanna, videoed by Joanna. And uh, hopefully uh, it'll come off and be a Oscar winning production. So let the show start. This thing all is coming about because of uh, challenges of the younger generation to know how to tie something securely onto a car, in, in specifically the canoe. And it's all got to do with knots. I know that there's many people in the world who want to use ratchet straps, but this is the non-ratchet strap show. So let's go. How to tie a canoe on. Two parts of this equation. One, tying the tying the anchor the anchoring the rope on one side of the canoe carrier, and two, doing the special loop and uh, tie knot on the other side and making it nice and tight. So here we go. The first knot is the bowline knot. Very simple. We put the rope around the the canoe the canoe rack, then we make a loop. I hope you can all see this. You send the line through the loop, around the line or the uh, the tree or wherever that story goes, and you make it tight. And you have here, presto, a bowline knot. Won't go loose, won't go tight. There's more to this story though, and we have to do this for right-handed people, because right-handed people have trouble interpreting what left-handed people are doing. So we are now going to repeat this and do it in right-handed fashion. So bear with me, you poor right-handers. Once again, same idea around the canoe carrier. You do your loop, same idea. You come through the eye, you go around the line. Then you see me fumbling here. And then you go back through the loop. See that? You go around the line, back through the loop. Simple. Make it tight, there you are. Never go loose, never go tight. Perfect. So that's it for side one. So patience a moment here as we throw the line over the canoe and amble around to the other side. Follow me. Okay, here we are. Ten seconds later finishing the job. And this is, bear with me, the most difficult part of the job. It takes concentration, it's challenging, and it's with reputation, reputation that you shall succeed. So I'm going to make myself a little easier, with, give myself a little easier access to the car. Oh, actually, I don't need to do that. So here we go again. We're doing this again in left-handed fashion, just for starters. Because left-handers have rights too. So we have a loop. We capture the loop with another loop. And what's really important is the tension has to be equal on both sides of this, this little loop situation. And then you have a loop that will never go loose. From here, you go once again around the canoe carrier. Through the through the the loop here, pull it down, make it tight, and at this point make any knot you want. But essentially, you just go around, make it tight, and as you can see, a team of horses couldn't make it loose. Now, of course, sorry, I know that there's many of my viewers are waiting for the right-handed bird. So I must do the right-handed version. I don't think it's much more difficult for a right-hander, but we'll demonstrate all the same. We begin, of course, with a loop. And with the left hand, we capture the loop in the same fashion with the right hand, with the left hand version. And you can see here, we've got a loop. That's it. You would again go around, through, make it tight. There's another little twist, wrinkle to this. 
If you would like a stronger and more durable solution, then you again take the loop, go around. You got that? Yeah. Very simple. You go around and you can go around again. So you have that less likely to ever slip out, not that there was any risk. And you go around again, go around the canoe carrier, up, down, reef it tight, put your favorite knot in here to, to hold it, and you're good. No trip to Canadian Tire necessary to get the ratchet straps on sale ever. And you can have some self-respect that you did this job yourself. Now, just for to go one moment further, if you're not believing in, if you have no faith in, in my loop, then you can also go back to the more simpler method of just putting an eye in up here. So, cameraman, can you come a little closer? I should say camera girl, or is it camera chick? So if you don't want to make my loop, which of course is very simple, you can just go through and make an eye like this. Same idea. Come down, round the carrier and up, and go tight. And put your own favorite knot in, and finished. The problem with this knot, if you haven't guessed, is that every time you use this rope, this loop will be in the wrong place. So, I can't see any reason why one wouldn't practice from dawn till dusk until they had second nature this very simple method which I learned from my... Uh, see? Oh, it's all so simple. Thank you. Goodbye.